What up, folks? And we're back again. Steve is here. And yeah, we got more X Men figures from the Age of Apocalypse wave. We got Marvel's Legion. I'm going to have some fun. So, we're going to just be checking a lot of figures tonight because after tonight, it's going to be hardcore, hardcore, busy, busy, busy stuff at work for me. So, I want to kind of enjoy myself. So, we'll just, you know, check out some figures tonight and finish this uh, Age of Apocalypse Colossus build a figure. So, that'd be awesome if we can finish that and we'll do a um maybe i don't know if an overview with that video and also get a our good buddy overlord overlord productions on that video too but yeah gotta check out marvel's legion this guy's a pretty interesting character at first i get i, I think this figure kind of looked goofy to me i was just like what what the hell and um and then i did some research and i already knew about the show legion but i never watched it but a buddy of mine chris him and his mom were big fans of that show and yeah, he was a love child of uh, Professor X and who else was it? Uh, Gabrielle Holler. So yeah, because his real name is David Charles Holler. So yeah, and um, yeah, son of Professor X. But I believe he's also, what does it say? Legion takes the role of an antihero who has a severe mental illness, including a form of dissociative identity disorder. So maybe like a multiple personality thing or whatever. But I think within those different personalities or whatever, or his disorder, he can have different mutant abilities. So that's pretty gnarly. Along with being like his, you know, um, dad, you know, Professor X. And having like telekinesis and all that stuff. And having like super duper mind powers, which is pretty cool. But yeah, we got to check him out, man. So I want to finish this wave. And um, it's... Yeah, we're going to start watching this show, too, just to check it out. At least check out the first episode and see what's up. But there you go. The son of Charles Xavier, Legion, gets his incredible mind from his legendary father, but must balance unimaginable mutant powers with his mental illness. So, yeah, there he is looking a little bit nutty. More figures in the wave. And we've already reviewed Magneto, Rogue, good old Sabretooth, and Iceman. So, yeah, we got these three left. Just Shadow Cat, Legion, and Cyclops. So yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Anyways, let's go ahead and bust them out and check them out. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. It says that his, um, I guess here in, in Wikipedia or whatever, that it's uh, 1990, well, let's see, created by Chris Claremont and Bill Sinswick. Um, that Legion made his debut in New Mutants number 25, 1985. So that's pretty crazy. It doesn't really say that much on the fandom page about that, but... Be interesting to go find those issues and check that out and see what's up with that because yeah he goes back that far from like 1985 to 2011 to 2017 so like a lot of different a lot of different comics and stuff so that's pretty cool man really cool anyways but yeah not a bad figure pretty much uh plain he's like got hospital scrubs like he's busted out of like you know an asylum or something like that or some kind of hospital and um nice blue wash on there a little dark blue pretty cool just basic buck nothing really you know too different about him but still pretty neat uh considering that his dad is professor x and he's got crazy mutant abilities and he's got really crazy like bart simpson kid and play hair or just like um was it wayne static or whatever and there's a little curly q right there right off the side so that's pretty cool too but um yeah man not a bad figure pretty much just probably just get him in like a i don't know standard like kind of like i don't know one of my standard poses for him to use his uh, mutant abilities here he is using his uh mind powers to maybe levitate this colossus leg and chunk it across the room <laughs> that's pretty cool or he could do i guess like he has he could do anything man maybe start fires maybe turn something into liquid who knows who knows what he could do maybe have like ice man's powers or like, or maybe, like, Wolverine's powers to regenerate, um, like, to heal or whatever and stuff like that, or self-heal, and, yeah, pretty neat figure, pretty basic, but the idea behind him and his origins and all that is actually really, really neat and really, really cool, and the fact that he could probably almost, like, in any given day or maybe any given time of the day have some kind of crazy powers, you know, that's actually really, really neat. It's nothing to scoff at, but, yeah. Comes with two extra fists, so that's cool. And uh, yeah, really neat character, man. I know he looks really basic, but beyond that, he's actually pretty cool, man. 
and knowing a little bit more about them and stuff is actually really cool. Pretty simple, but yet at the same time, he's got some powers, and his dad is Professor X for crying out loud, you know? Uh, pardon me. Anyways, yeah, pretty neat figure, man. I like him, man. He's, he's a keeper. Definitely a keeper. Definitely going to watch the show. Definitely want to see if I can find any of the comics and stuff. If we can find any free comics to read about him, that'd be kind of cool. And yeah, man, and um, I actually have some old New Mutants comics, maybe one, or, I think, uh, or a few, actually, like from the era before the X-Force, and maybe like a super, super old one from way, way back in the day, but um, but not the said number, like, 24 through 26 or anything like that, which he would have made his appearance, yeah, number 25, 1985, so that is pretty interesting. Anyways, that's a look at Legion, he's a pretty basic figure, not a whole lot going on with him, but there's a whole lot going on here in his ticker so yeah that, that's that's pretty freaking neat man. pretty freaking cool anyways thanks for watching y'all and uh more videos coming up pretty soon and I almost forgot yeah we're getting closer to building this crazy colossus so yeah it's gonna be really neat too once we're done with that anyways um let me know what you think about this figure what you think about this character if you know anything about him or not or if you ever seen the show or read the comics let me know let me know what you know anyways thanks for watching y'all and have a good one all right later